Just recently, there was a well-publicized case of bullying here at Severna Park High School, but school officials say this is a problem that extends throughout the county. When a kid is bullied and made fun of in front of their friends, it's like an assault and we need to take it seriously. So parents, educators and community members gathered Monday to talk about inclusion, diversity and how to make every student in Anne Arundel County feel accepted. They gathered at Severna Park High School where a couple of weeks ago a video was airdropped to the building showing a student bullying another student with special needs. And I wasn't surprised, but I think it's a wake up call that we need to continue to monitor, continue to progress and pay attention to this important issue. The principal addressed that particular incident, saying the perpetrator is no longer a student at Severna Park High and outlining new steps they're taking. But this assembly is about more than just that one incident, and the new superintendent says he's committed to changing the system through transparency and honesty. It's bigger than inclusivity, right? It is about access. It is about acceptance. It is about a sense of belonging. You accomplish those three things, you far exceed being inclusive as a system. Those who attended Monday broke into small groups for school system employees to get honest feedback and suggestions about how to proceed. The superintendent says those suggestions will be made public on their website. I feel that the supports aren't there for Anne Arundel County to support my child um, with special needs. And then also as part of that, I think there needs to be curriculum um, supports uh, aids and, and a variety of other things that need to be put in place and strengthened. We need to be starting teaching kids to listen and understand and respect differences from the time they start school. The superintendent says they will consult with their legal team and look at their policies to see if anything needs to change. In Severna Park, Kim Day, CWBAL, TV 11 News.